Hey, what's up? Dark Sky coming at you with a uh, new awesome game uh, called Kaku Ancient Seal. It's, man, this game is awesome. I uh, played a little bit into it, but I didn't want to go too far. I wanted to share it with you guys. But uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. It's uh, It's got a little guy that, uh, you know, that has a little pet uh, piglet. But I don't want to spoil it for you guys. Let's get into this and see what's going on. All right, and here we are. We are trying to get out of this place. Uh, so I guess we'll head towards these things here. You can do the uh, the shift jump to get up here. Looks like we're going to need to do double shift to kind of jump up this one. Oh, here's, this is definitely a double shift to jump up right here. There we are. And on to the opening we go. some mushrooms these mushrooms are good they're great for uh for healing especially in tight situations we're gonna be in a lot of those on the way through this uh adventure so make sure we pick up plenty of them also maybe get some mushrooms just for like a little high healing along the way uh what is this here it looks like oh it almost looked like there was like something secret right there all right, but uh, let's continue on down the way here. We'll continue picking up these uh, mushrooms, picking up, I don't know what these things are called, Kyle and Fire. Woo. All right, now we gotta act like Bam Bam here from Fred Flintstone and put some sense into these little pigs. We go knock them unconscious and then uh, and then finish them off. Cool cop. Ah. 
That uh, my my bang boomstick won't take care of. And that's how it's done. <laughs> hey, look down a, a lot of are you? Oh, hey, look, you took down a lot of boars. You're quite the fighter, kid. Thanks to you, reminder. <laughs> Or else, it could have been a tough fight. Old man, are you sure you didn't see a pink piglet? I told you, I don't see any piglet. Saw plenty of big boars, though. Fine, stomach growling. Well, I'm starving after the fight. I'll have some fruit to get some energy back. Wait a minute. You're not cooking it. Coo, what, coo? I said cook. Putting ingredients in a stone pot and cooking them to bring out their best flavors. First, you put the ingredients in the stone pot. My pot is broken. Cool. Uh, I think you accidentally knocked it over when you ran away just now. Go to the forest. There should be an abandoned camp. Find some materials to repair the pot and bring them back to me. All right, let's go to get those uh, little pot repairs, repair pot stuff. Yeah. Keep thinking that shift means that I can run faster, but it's not. It's uh, oh, and by the way, these little stones here, you use the stones to kind of save your area. Uh, you can see down in the uh, lower bottom, it has like a little um, like a snail thing that pops up every time you click on those, uh, but they're not right now. When they highlight again, then you can save it again. Oh, look at that. You can see pigs up there and some... Um, that's a huge beehive. Yep, I agree. Sprinting, jumping, running, or attacking near beehives. Okay, I can do that. There's a chest hidden here. And it's locked. There must be something valuable inside. Those two snow beasts ahead seem just as tough as the white boar. With their tough skin, I should be able to take them down with my arm blade. Huh. Well, we got this guy here, so let's just take him down. Crazy looking dodo bird. All right, we'll pick up some of this just for food. I mean, not for food, but in case we get attacked. Now, if we do get attacked, uh, let's see here. We have, um, so we have one, two, three, and four down there that we can use, so. All right. There we go. My mouse was stuck there for a minute. It wouldn't let me turn around to look. So if we, uh, if our health gets down a little bit, then we can always do the one, two, three, four, and that should be able to kind of get us turned around. Okay, let's knock those guys into submission, and then we'll show them how it's done. Take them out of commission. There we go. Open up our chest and see what our reward is. <laughs> Wild Fang headband. Ooh, nice. All right, let's see what that looks like, huh? Go into our inventory. Oh, looks like we got some uh, new hide armor, too. Nice. Oh, I guess we're... What? Oh, this? Oh, cool. There we go. Nice. And then, uh, let's see here, what do we got else? Uh, go back to character, to the headband. There we go. We are looking sharp. Good to go there. All right, so let's see what else we got going on here. We got uh, 
some things over here. Let's see. Oh, there's another boar dude. Beat 10 monsters. Definitely done that. Ooh, now that's quite the drop right there. I suspect we should not be going down that way. What do we got over here? More food. Oh, a piggy. Boom, dead. All right, nice. Pick up the food, get these. Oh, pot pieces, nice. Plus one. Let's see, we got a uh, quest up here on the uh, upper right-hand side of the screen. We got to search the camp for uh, repair materials. So let's uh, keep thinking that shift button is a... Um, is like a uh, sprint. When it's not, it just makes me roll. Got knocking those dodos out of the park. Pick these pot pieces up. Get these back to the old guy. We need to find one more camp here. Let's see, where's the last camp at? I don't want to do anything around that beehive if I can help it. See, maybe what? Maybe it's over here? Uh, did I skip one or something? Skip a possible uh, spot? No, I got that spot there. I don't see anything back that way. It says it's in this uh, vicinity. Oh, see, now it's lit up again. We can go here, see, and then we can do uh, this kind of saber game. But I don't see where this last one is. It says it should be in this vicinity. Did I skip it somewhere? Oh, there's something here. Oh, there we go. That was the last piece. All right, now let's, let, let's return back to that geezer with the materials. <laughs> yeah, respect the elders there, huh? I'm telling them they're a geezer, an old geezer. <laughs> All right. <laughs> old man, I've gathered materials for repairs. Tell me if you need more. Let me see. Good, excellent. That should do it. A little this, a little that, and here, there. As good as new. Take all the ingredients, put them in, cook for a while, and you'll be ready to eat. Oh. That's it? As simple as that? What's so hard about putting ingredients in? Go. Okay, yeah, that, that definitely seems easy enough. Oh, yeah, that's going to be simple dimple. Let's get her done. So we can do uh, we can do some of that. Looks like we should do some of that. We can't do any of those. So let's. Uh, I don't know. Do I need this? Island fire, huh? Well, let's just make the max of that, huh? And can we make a max of that? There we are. See escape. So it does taste better. I should bring something else. Like I sometimes uh, stuff like really uh, goes fast, so it's hard to read. Here, taste this. Hmm, not bad. It would be better even with some honey. Honey. 
I did just see a huge beehive out there, but I was too scared to even move. A beehive? Here, take this. Next time you see one, stand at a distance and shoot it down. But this little twig? It's not just some little twig. It's Hunter's Slingshot. It's a handy tool, you know. You can use it to fight the monsters and shoot down the resources from high places. See those oars at the edge of the cliff? Try shooting them down with a slingshot. Alright, so hit that R and... We knock those down. There we go. Hey, there's Piglet! Oh, that don't look good. Oh. This plant looks really dangerous. Better keep my distance. What even is this? It's all over the place. Mm. I've been doing some research, and it seems to have something to do with the imbalance of the four elements. With the turmoil and unusual weather, something must have happened at the elemental temple. So how should we deal with this plant thing? It's blocking the way. I know a type of pellet that should be able to destroy them. Just tell me what it is, old man. You go out there and collect some special ores. Come back to the camp when you're done. Back to the camp? Why? Stop asking questions. Just go before you lose the piglet again. I'll tell you everything when you come back. Hold on. Look at the beehive on the stone bridge. You can try shooting it down in the distance with the slingshot. I'm telling you, you don't want to mess with them. Got it. See you. All right, so we're going to shoot these uh, things down. So if we shoot these down in the distance, we shouldn't have too many issues. So... Another beehive. I'll try shooting it down. All right, let's do it. Let them kind of do all their buzzing around so I don't uh, get stung. I don't want to be stung. It doesn't even sound like a good good thing that could happen to you, you know? Okay. Wow, so many boars. Is there a den nearby? How do I get close? A beehive. I'm definitely not getting near that. Wait, maybe it can help me out. <laughs> Let's see what happens if I shoot the beehive. All right, I'm thinking I'm going to like shoot the beehive and then just kind of hide and let everything. <laughs> well, they kind of seem to come after me, don't they? Well, it took down most of them, didn't it? I suppose I could just shoot the rest. No, well, I can't even shoot the right angle. Darn. All right. Well, I just guess I go do it the old-fashioned way. All right. One last little guy here to go. Let's come on. There we go. Little bam, bam action. Wham, bam, and got it done. All right, see here. So they got some stones on the side. Oh, that's cool. But let's go over here. Let's pick up some of these. Get some food back into us. We'll pick that up. I think that's some of that ore. There's some wood there. Pick up some of this stuff here. And then let's get uh, some of the stone up here. We got a little save point right here. We'll use that. And uh, we'll go back through here, pick up all this stuff. I think more the merry, you know, you can't have too much resources, you know what I mean? You never know what's going to happen. So just gather everything like it uh, as if uh, your life depended on it. 
All right, let's get that over there. Anything down there? I don't see anything. Pick this up. And we got another stone here. There we go. Okay, anything down there? That looks that looks a little dangerous. Let's uh, go over here. There's another one of those crazy looking plants over there. Oh my goodness. Alright, so now we're going to go back up here. I think what we're going to do is go back to the old uh, geezer. Oh? Old man, I've gathered the materials. Tell me if you need more. Mm. That's more than enough. So what's next? Take all these materials to the crafting table over there. Combine the raw materials you brought back on the pellet crafting table and make special pellets. Cool. Sounds amazing. I'm on it. All right. Let's get her done. Yep. I see it. Oh, that's cool. Like you turn the little crystals into little, little balls. It's like a poison ball, a fireball. And like electric ball. All right, let's craft some of these these bad boys. Huh? Just do maximum. Take them all. Don't have any of those, so we don't need to worry about that. Ooh. Use the elemental pellets to destroy the obstacle. So we need to do R two first off. So get the uh, pellets ready. And then we're gonna go in and we're gonna take this uh this bad boy out so it looks like we used the green ones on the uh the weird i don't know uh spiky looking thing yellow ones use the red ones on the uh the little tiny clams and then use the uh, electric electricity there one on the little blue balls there so let's uh yeah this looks good let's do that Really? One shot. Wow. I am that good. <laughs> All right, old man, let's go through. We gotta get Piglet. Where's my Piglet? It's like we got another enemy down here that needs to shave and a haircut. All right, let's take out these guys. Piece of cake. All right, so I'll pick up this. And where's the other one? He's here, I think, what? Oh, they're the, uh, the poison looking ones, huh? Does it mean that this guy here is going to do some kind of a poison attack? Oh, yep, that's what he is. He's like a poison attack kind of guy. So we're going to need to uh, make some different things for him. And let's run in to, to get this guy here. Whew. Man, it is hitting me. Oh, let's eat one of those things. Oh, I got it. I got it. I got it. There we go. Let's see what's in this chest here. Oh, we got the stone spike stick. Oh man. Now we now we now we're in the money. We got money going on here. Let's see here. Let's switch out the stick at the uh new improved stick. Yep, that looks pretty good. Now we got the Bam Bam stick. We take, we're gonna take him out. We're gonna send him back to a whole new level. Oh, look at that! Those things just keep spawning. Awfully nice. 
Okay, so now what I need to do is switch to that one there. I got eight of those bad boys, so I'm pretty good. Ooh, I have been taking these like, oh, pause again. It's all right. I can handle this. Oh, he's got like, I can't tell if he has one hit left on him or what. Oh, damn, that hurts. That hurts. Ouch, ouch, ouch. There we go. Man, that took a couple of hits. I think I got had to do three hits on that guy. All right, let's get up here and see where Piglet went. Poor little Piglet. Missing me. I need him. Ah, uh, Piglet, I should sneak up on you. Unless I can get him far enough away. No, darn it, that did not work. That's plan. Oh no, Piglet's running off. I'll show you my new Bam Bam stick, buddy. Yeah. That it? Did I get that other one? I don't know I got that other one so quickly. It looks like, I think there's a uh, secret right here. Oh, that's trippy. All right, here we go. Yeah, we got a secret. Nice. What do we get from this? Just more resources. I thought we were going to get some uh, piece of armor or something. No love. No love there. All right, we got uh, we got a stone over here. Let's pick that up. Thought there might have been something up there, but nope. Now yeah, here we go. <laughs> I don't know what that was all about. Oh, look, there's some stone, new stone stuff up here. Let's see, we gotta talk to the old geezer. Old oh, man, or what do we do now? Maybe the piglet went that way. If we can just open this gate, we should be able to catch up with it. Look up there. The energy stones next to the stone gate should be the key. Huh? There are two empty slots below. Hmm. These four spots should be correspond to the four elements of this world. Four elements. Legend has it that the saga created the world using four elements. Wind fire, water, and earth. The two stones on the gate represent the elements of wind and water. So if we find the other two, we can just open this gate, right? I guess. Go see if there's anything suspicious around here. There might be a hidden energy stone. Hmm. Someone's coming. Huh, okay, that didn't go as planned. Okay, we'll take out these bad boys. 
And then we got to take out the big guy, looks like, with the big, ginormous staff. Look at that staff. That's crazy big. Ooh, dang it, he got me. Lucky hit. Ooh, come on, get up, get up. Almost got him. Just a little bit more. There we go. Let's go over here and save. There we go. See what the old guy's got to say. Four elements, magic, temples. What's the old man mumbling about? Hey, old man. Oh, you, you little bastard. You almost gave me a heart attack. What are you mumbling about? What temple? Those stone paintings depict ancient tales. Saga placed the souls of the four elements in a hidden place. The Pon Pon are Saga's followers. They constructed the elemental temples where they have worshipped for generations. <laughs> the world has changed in a bad way and the Pon Pons are becoming unusually aggressive. What's going on with all of this? Something must have happened at the temple. You go search for the energy stones to open the gate. I need to do some further research on these stone murals. You better be working on your research instead of slacking off. Just go leave me alone. <laughs> all right, all right. What a nice guy, huh? There's a bunch of stone stuff over here. The chest here. Oh, we got a stone arm guard. Nice. Very nice. All right, let's see if we can change that out there. Huh? Okay, so we got that way we have to go. And I'm thinking maybe the other one's up there somewhere. I don't know check this one out here's got some stuff around the edges let's grab this pick these uh, stones up and let's jump down below and see what's down here huh chest is playing hard to get it's gone i can't believe the chest just ran away i'll take it'll take some effort to open it let's go after it these mushrooms look suspicious careful oh there we go let's do that there take care of those bad boys Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Come on. There we go. <gasps> yeah, that's how you take those guys out. That's nice. Somebody's already angry at us, and we haven't even gotten over there yet. There we go. We'll take those guys out and use the mushrooms to, or the flowers here, to get rid of the, uh, the poison in the air. So we are able to travel through here and get what we need. Now it's just an easy run. Oh, missed one. That's yeah, all right. As long as I'll go close to it, I guess I'm all right. Oh, I forgot to get the uh, this one here. 
There we go. Hello. Our chest keeps running. Can't run no more. There we go. Just kick it open. Ah, dang it. Hurt my foot. <laughs> oh, we got one of the energy stones. Nice. Alright, let's run up here. We'll grab the uh, the last uh, stone that we require to move forward. So there's the next stone up there. Go up here, we'll grab what we need from these guys. There we go, pick this up. You will drag this back down here. Hold control to run. Okay. There we go. I was wondering what the control was. Or what uh, button the run was. Alright. Put that down there. Pick this up. And this. Open this chest. Yeah. Darn it. Keep kicking it. Hurt my foot. <laughs> Alright. We got the last gem that we need. Run back over here and talk to the old man again. Tell him the good news. I wonder if I can jump down this. Yep, I can. All right, let's put this in a spot. Old man, what's the place over there? I think we have found the entrance to the temple. Is it the same temple as depicted in the murals? We're really lucky. The entrance looks badly damaged. Something must have happened here. Indeed, it looks like a disaster struck here. Huh. Was that the piglet it just flew over? I believe it was. Let's go over here. We'll save this up. I think what I want to do is get these guys, because I don't trust going close enough to these. There we go. And then if we do a uh, a jump jump shift, we can actually kind of jump over this area right here. There we go. Oh, there we go. We got a stone slingshot. Now we are a gold. Oops, don't do that. Uh, jump, jump, shift. There we go. We'll go over here, pick up this, uh, those little goodies. Is there some over here? Is. Let's uh, get rid of this guy first. There we go. We'll get rid of, uh, get those things out. Pick those up. There should be a bad guy right here. I just, do I not see him? Oh, no. What a majestic temple. Hmm. There's a steli up ahead. I feel like the mysterious steli is calling out to me. Let's go take a look. It might be useful. We get some more of this. 
here's the area over here where we can make our uh, our tax a little bit stronger that so that's awfully nice and we just so happen to have both of those gems so there we are so let's upgrade i'm thinking doing the uh let's do the weapon attack maybe yeah i'm thinking the weapon attack would probably be a good one and that's all we have available to be able to purchase any of this all right good and let's check out this one here consume those learning abilities refund all spent sacred stones can reset all learned abilities oh okay that's cool So I'm thinking that, um, let's see, please, there's a slice. That actually looks kind of nice. Slice looks kind of nice. I'm a poet and didn't know it. Uh, this one here is a charge blow. Nah. Backslash volley. Huh. This one here is more for our range. This one here seems to be more for... I don't know. Just, oh, for punching. Okay. But let's do... I'm thinking this one here. Ultimate Ability Flame Fury. Wow, that's pretty cool. Uh, let's do this one right here. This is kind of nice. So we do three clicks of the mouse, and then we do uh, the le left mouse button, and then we do one right, and then we get like a, uh, like a super damaged uh, combo. So that might be nice. Let's do that one. All right, so we are good. So let's exit out of that. And I want to get this guy here out of the way. Divine Glory. Oh, that's interesting. Huh, never seen those stones before. Uh, let's do it from this distance out here, I think. Where we can get both of these guys knocked down. There we are, good. We are good to go. Pick up some shrooms. Pick out this guy here. Oh, this guy's coming fast. Oh, man, he got in there. There we go. Man, that guy, you like it. <laughs> he charged me fast before I even had a chance to do anything. Yeah, lucky attack. Divine glory. I wonder what that's for. That must be the what we need for upgrading and everything, huh? Why can't I get that one? There we go. All right, we got a chest here. Let's see what's in the chest. Get some more goodies. Oh, we got all kinds of pellets and stuff. It's uh, you know, if they're giving us a bunch of pellets and stuff, you know that there's something nasty coming up. Oh, look at this. Dang it, guy, man. Good. Get out of there. Oh, let's heal up a little bit. Oh, there's that awesome slash. <laughs> oh, I can't believe I wasted it on that, though. Huh? There we go. Knocked him out of the ballpark. I'm thinking what I want to do is do a quick save just in case, because I don't want to do that little fight again if, uh, if something doesn't work out quite well. well. Actually, there's something over here. Let's grab these. There we go. And then we'll run out, jump down here. We'll uh, use this right quick. All right. 
I'm thinking there's going to be some kind of a boss or something right at the top of these stairs. Or not. No, no. Not much here, is there? Oh, it's a suspense. That's cool. That's why I kill a guy right away. All right, come on, swing at me. Give me it. You at your. Oh, lucky hit. Lucky hit. Good thing I got plenty of heals. All right. I don't like that. It's a meal in there. Dang it. Come on, heal up there. Oh. We got him, but uh, he healed back up the full. What's up with that? Oh, man, he almost got me there. Oh. Get out of the way. Oh, man, that almost got me. Heal up. Heal up. Oh, dang. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. There we go, heal back up the fool. Dang it. Stay out of the way. Stay out of the way. Do I have any more of those heals, man? I tell you. Oh, no, you don't. All right, let's do uh, three here. Does that do anything? Nope, nothing. Dang, I don't have any, any more of those heals. Dang. Come on. Come on, a little more. There we go. There we go. Oh, <laughs> 
Kabum. Kabum. Okay, we're gonna need to eliminate these claws. Let's see, four. Oh, nice. Now we mean trouble. Oh, now we're kicking butt. Let's see if I can move forward. There we go. We really hit those guys hard, huh? Stone, what should we do now? It seems Baggy's mind has been corrupted by the dark energy, and I don't know what to do. You should go on adventure with Kaku. Maybe you can find a solution. Don't worry, I've got this. Cool. Let's set off and find Baggy. How am I supposed to find Baggy when the world is so big? Additionally, you'll need to reach the ruins realm to enhance yourself runes realm how do i get there i can open a portal to the runes realm then what are we waiting for let's go now let's see what uh, we got so we got to open press f1 hey hold down f1 there we go there we go oh how come this place is shrouded in dark mist? The only thing unaffected is that big ring over there. I can help you reach there with my power, but you'll have to activate the star altar by yourself. Me? Fine. I guess I, I don't have a choice. Let's go, piggy. So use the middle button and three... Oh, yeah, F3, you gotta hold on. There we go. Use that to run across the water before a timer runs out. And then this, and hold F2. That's easy enough.
Wow, magnificent. So this is the Ruins Realm. The four different regions in the distance correspond to the four elemental continents, each filled with underground ruins. However, the ruins are filled with deadly traps and dumb stones. That sounds dangerous. High risk comes with high rewards. There are loads of treasure chests inside. There are also totems that can boost your stamina and health, but you'll need a runes key before entering the runes. Huh. You need a runes key to unlock the underground runes? In that case, let's go back to the floating island and ask the big stones how we can get the elemental continents to find the runes key. Okay, F1 again. So the Ruins Realm is where I can level up and enhance myself? That's awesome, Big Stone. Great. Next, you and Piglet will embark on your adventure. Adventure? What adventure? With the disappearance of the four elemental souls, the disaster striking each continent are signs of the elemental imbalance. An unprecedented disaster is coming, and it's your destiny to stop it. Wow, sounds challenging. What am I supposed to do? You should consist... The world consists of four continents, each with a temple built in a hidden place. Saga, with his divine power, extracted the souls of four elementals. They're the key to the balance of the world. The souls are worshipped in the sanctuary of the temples. You should find them and bring them back to the floating island, after which I will tell you what to do. You can count on me. Let's go. Hold on. The elemental continents are fraught with danger. Here, take this stone. What is this? These are rune stones, sacred stones forged by Saga during the creation of the runes realm. Rune stones bear Saga's blessing and can be socketed into equipment. They offer extra power-ups to make the you unstoppable on the battlefield. Sounds amazing. I must try it out. Once you have learned about the rune stones, say goodbye to your old friend before coming back to me. So now we can uh, choose equipment and socket rune stones into them, so that's pretty sweet. But anyways, this is, uh, this is a good spot for me to uh, end my episode for today. I really appreciate you guys coming along on this venture. This has been an awesome uh, deal. Uh, please smash that subscribe button and hit that like. Comment down in the comment section below. And you'll find more information about this game in the uh, description uh, below, as well as where to purchase it. I hope to see you on the next one. You take care now, and bye-bye.